Hello spinner, you're on pen stock channel about pen spinning. My name is Alex Lanz and today I will show you major pen spinning tricks from basics to pro. Yeah, I divided all tricks into five different categories according to their supposative difficulty level in order to make it easier for you to orientate in their great variety. Okay, the first level – basic pen spinning tricks, which most of beginners learn with a simple pen or with a victor mode. They are fairly hard to learn with a simple pen, but people manage to do them. Still, I would recommend to make at least victory mode. I have a video tutorial of how to do it, it's not that complicated. So I recommend you to make at least it, otherwise your learning might become a living hell. Especially when you would you might want to learn charge continuous or oh, finger pass. Basic pen tricks, yeah, but they are close to impossible to master without a pen mod. After learning basic pen spinning tricks, you can already try to connect them in such a mini combo. And it's going to be 10 times more spectacular than just charge continuous. Well, finger pass looks dope, yeah. But boy, how much time it needs to become perfect. During this time, you could upgrade your skill level up to I don't know, third level. All in all, passing the first level will take you about a week or two. It will heavily depend on how fast you can learn charge. One, this trick took me a week to learn or so. Well, others I could do after about two hours of practicing for each of them. Second level, beginner tricks. And you're going to spend some time on this level, as it lets you to have a glimpse of pen on pen spinning. It can give you a vague, a very vague idea of what it is. At this level you will understand whether you actually like pen spinning or solely learn tricks to flex in class or in office. Which is totally okay, of course, don't get me wrong, I'm both hands up for flexing in class. And guys, beginner level is already okay for flexing. So if you master tricks from it and can combine some of them into mini combos at least, that's already enough to attract a lot of eyeballs of your crush, for example. And I can tell you even more. I have a video about how to flex like a pro when you are a noob. In that video I compiled a few pen spinning elements, which are fairly easy to learn, but which look astonishing. Too awesome video for everyone to see. So let's keep it in a secret, I even won't place link to it in the description. No. That's, that's too ninja. So, beginner level, the most crowded one, as it already gives you opportunity to create or repeat combos and have a lot of fun with them. <laughs> Especially if you already have something like flower, finger dance, travel mode, or maybe even flying panda, Ivan mode, or who knows, maybe waterfall, then you already can do stuff like that. Third level, intermediate. Now that's time to separate the men from the boys. Here you already understand concept of doing combos and actually start doing them. Yeah, on previous levels you kinda pretend that you can do pen spinning stuff. Here you actually become kinda pen spinner. You will spend more time on doing combos with the elements you already know than learning new tricks, as your trick library is now pretty big and you will need to master all of them. And mastering a trick requires you to be able to link it to at least three other tricks. And also, at this level your combos are finally interesting to watch by pen spinning. Spinners. Let's be real, flexing with the simple tricks will impress only people who have no idea about pen spinning, or maybe know it on a very surface level. Other pen spinners have close to zero interest in your attempts to look like a pro. <laughs> Also, now you begin to realize that all modes are very different, that different pen spinning elements are easier to make with different pen spinning mods, that each pen mod feels and spins differently and you like some more and some less. Well, in general, you begin to understand the importance of having a good pen mod. They begin to delight you more than, I don't know, new game, even maybe new girl. <laughs> You serious? That's the time when you begin to fully understand pen spinning and enjoy it. That's the level when you really become a pen spinner and there is no way back. Pen spinning has you and you can't get away from it. Even if you quit, you will return. Pen spinning can wait and it will. Fourth level advanced pen spinning tricks. When you learn a certain amount of tricks from previous levels, after learning new links, mini combos, combos from my channel, from for example, you will want to spice them up, to add some complexity. That's the time when you will begin to add tricks from this level into your trick library and implement them one by one. You will begin to realize that some elements are more fun to do for you. For example, you will understand that you 
like to create new original elements, or maybe focus on doing continuous tricks, or spend days on developing smoothness of your moves. That's the level when your style will become visible. It is formed by pen mode you spin most and elements you focused on most. You begin to spend much less time on learning new tricks and focus on things you like more in pen spinning. And in any case, you will begin to freestyle more than learn something new. And here is a little problem of this level. Well, all of the levels have some catches, but that's the topic for another video. Fifth level, pro tricks. There are much more of them than I can really show it, at least right now, as I don't focus on learning new tricks at this point. There is still so much to do on previous levels. Fifth level means that you finally are done with the learning and finally can become fully, truly troop and spinner. It is like a high level in world of Warcraft. The whole universe is now open and the, the journey begins. On this level you begin to understand how deep pen spinning is, that you can find a whole bunch of different stuff to do now. You like shift from a paddling pool to a huge sea, to an ocean of possibilities. Nothing is impossible anymore and you can grab any insane thing you see and learn it. You can do any imaginable thing you can create in your mind. Limits are off and pen spinning world is totally open for you. I wish you good luck with all that. May the style be with you. Bye.